Okay. Thanks for coming in for those of you. Uh, this is a makeup class for the 4th of April, which I was hospitalized and discharged on 4th of April in the late afternoon. So thank you for coming in. So I appreciate it very much um, for taking the time on Tuesday. And of course, I will see you. Um, wait <coughs> Um, of course, I will see you both, uh, Han Lin Tian, Yung Zachary, and Kang Yang, on this coming Thursday on the 25th of April. Uh, we will still uh, continue this Thursday lesson, uh, but this Tuesday lesson is a makeup of 4th of April, right? Thank you. So both of you cannot see me. I, I can see you, so never mind. Well, let's start the lesson proper. I think I shared the wrong one, sorry. Oh, it should be this one, sorry. Okay. Well done. So we got uh, this one here. Okay, let's move it down. All right. Okay, it's pretty hot today, huh? I hope you all can. Uh, take in more water to hydrate yourself. Okay, so we we'll talk about day three, how social and can transform the economy. Uh, then you, will you mind reading this, please? Are you there, Tenyu? Tenyu, are you there, Tenyu? There's an Ari, 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 Ari. Oh. Yeah, but right. I saw wait, wait, wait. I also need to can you acknowledge me because I can't we can't talk into a blank air space. Okay, so let's wait for him. Whether are you there? Can you call it once, call it twice? Tung, tung, tung to paging Mr. Can you please come to the counter? <laughs> so have you oh, ever done like service like that before? Like those type of service, have you? Uh I don't think so. I haven't. Oh. Can you imagine that dun, 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 calling Mr. Chen Huan? Please come I mean, to the I mean like the airport. You share that very often at airport. Ma. Yeah, yeah. Oh. But this one's different. Sometimes it's shopping center. The shopping or, or center, shopping center be rare. Shopping center is only yeah. when the child when the child, when child, when the child missing. When the child missing. When yeah. the child missing, then you can hear. Otherwise, oh. usually you won't have. So can you imagine dun, 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 calling Mr. Chen Huan? Please come to the counter. Your wife is taking a hammer. Run if you can. Hide if you can. But don't come to the counter. Thank you. Oh my God. What have you done, man? <laughs> Hello, Mr. Tianyu. Are you there now? Can you can, can I send a message to him? Uh? I read OCD on uh, If people don't reply me, I feel very uneasy. I need people to talk to me. <laughs> Speak to me. <laughs> <coughs> All right, let's go. All right, definition. How social can transform the economy? Social transformation means the restructuring of all aspects of life, from culture to social relations, from politi policy, politics to economy, from the way we think to the way we live. What is social economic transformation? Social economic transformation is commonly defined as a process in which an increasing proportion of economic output and employment are gener generated by sectors other than agriculture. Social change can lead to economic growth in several ways. Okay, since we can't hear Tenyu, it's like between you and me, yeah. Uh, and Kan Yao, by the way, uh, I think he fractured his left leg, me. Uh. <laughs> so I'm not the only one. Well, he was quite bad, no, he was doing Wushu. Uh. Then when he was jumping in the air, I saw the video, bam! I tell you the whole knee cap, I think, oh my god, swollen like shit, man. Oh, uh, very bad. And then Zachary, I think today. <laughs> I hope you recover soon. Uh, he's cast on cast, but the cast took up. Then uh, Zachary is on the NSG, huh? National School Games. Or something. Yeah, so it might be late. Anyway, uh, can this apply to Hitler? Sorry? Sorry? Can this one apply to Hitler? Uh, no. This... no. Why? Okay, Um. firstly, Hitler was not... Hitler's uh, uprising was not a social change. It was an uh, industrial 
the the change in the German economy to uh, prepare for war was an industrial change. It was not a social change. The social change wasn't a choice by the people, but rather enforced upon the people. Okay. Then what about Lenin? Uh, Stalin. Oh uh, yes, because um, after winning a civil war, right? Who fight? He fight with who? He fight with um. Uh, I mean, wait, Len. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so he won the who, fight who against the Bolsheviks. Who is Lenin? Who is Lenin? The Bo yes. uh, Lenin won against uh, won the fight against the Bolsheviks, ma. So meaning that was a social. I'm talking about Stalin, the brother. Oh, not Stalin, Lenin. Stalin. Oh, yes. oh, I heard the wrong thing. Sorry, sorry. Never uh, Stalin, mind. Uh, Stalin, uh, no, because there was no social reform. It was just communist all the way. Huh? Stalin don't have. Uh? You don't have, don't have. But, no, by the time Stalin took over, the whole country was already completely communist. There was like, there was uh, barely any reform, right? No, bro. That's why you know what's your problem. In fact, both also got social issue. The problem is your textbook never mentioned about Stalin. Stalin got two policies, the industrialized industrialization and collectivizations. In fact, both also I only learned about I only learned about the industrialization. Correct law. So sad, right? See, misleading already. Right. Those, those dad, were elect, we're elect history students, so like we don't, no, we don't the previous them. elect history students got a full chapter about Stalin, about how Lenin came into power, threw away the the because the Tsar, and then uh, start the October Revolution with the Red Army, and finally they got take over them as a communist USSR. Ah, uh, where where were you just now? Oh no, I I went to get something. I went to toilet also. Oh okay okay. So my bad, my bad. Uh, no problem. Zach, are you able to turn on your camera? So if you ask me, uh, to be honest, uh, hi Zach, oh, you, you look very thin uh, after the game. Uh. He may have uh. He's so uh, Is it uh, the, the lighter you are, the, the ceiling will be better, is it? Too heavy, cannot, uh, the shit cannot move. Uh. You eat very little. Eh? Hello, Kang Yao. Are you able to see me? I, I can't see you. Hey, Kang Yao, what happened to your leg, man? Are you recovering? Uh? Oh. Oh, by the way, guys, please send your best wishes and recovery wishes to Kang Yao, where he fractured his Kang leg. Yao, what happened to you? He fractured his leg, right? Left leg, right? Alama. Oh, wait, are you at the hospital right now? What? No, no, no. I'm not. Uh, it's, it's, it's not fractured. It's the blood clot. Huh? Blood oh. clot. Hey, but the way you fly so, out you know. the sky, no, wait, wait. Can you, you hope this out. But the way he flew okay. out to the sky and then landed, uh, it's not fractured. Uh, it's blood clot. Uh. Yeah, blood clot. Yeah. Oh, lucky, man. I saw you put on cast, eh? The cast is because the doctor thought it was a fracture and or I tore my ACL because he, she, he cannot feel it at first. So he... Then go x-ray, man. What, what kind of doctor is this? He never sent you for x-ray, ah? No, he did x but he was 12. So x-ray, he x-ray. But oh, x-ray is fracture. What is 12? Uh, 12 a.m. Or midnight? Yeah. Which hospital? Uh, Glen Eagles at Napier Street. Why well, you never go like Parkway? No, because you yeah. stay around that area. Yeah, la, but then Parkway got A&E. Any time of the day, they will help you actually. Uh, but remember the claim from your school insurance. Oh. Oh, it's it's it. because you are injured during school activities. Okay, mm -hmm. you must claim. Uh. And then how is your leg now? Or your left leg? Uh, It's not swollen. It's better. I can bend can it. You walk? I can walk, but, I'm not sure, but I don't think the doctor doesn't don't advise me to walk with our crutches. So you have, you are on crutches to school? Uh? uh yeah. So when do you go back to school? I went back to school at uh last last uh Tuesday. Well, you no, realize no, uh, last Wednesday, Wednesday. You see uh, bro, you realize uh, that is so life is really uh FML uh, up and down uh. Never mind. Uh, last Saturday I also nearly go to hospital again the third emergency. Uh. Uh, life is so fragile. Anyway, uh, 祝你早日康复, uh, uh, but I like the way you see the, the other two are flying halfway only. Well, you are the third flyer, right? The third person who came in, right? Yeah. Well, you really flew them freaking high, right? You really don't want me, uh, Daka. <laughs> Why are you talking to me? The way you fly, you're like you're flying, 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 Oh my goodness, the two guys only acting, acting, yeah, from. He really fight out. <laughs> wow. 
，如果成龙看你啊，看到你啊，可能他拍叫你拍啊、呃《新警察故事》第六集啊，肯定会去那边。<笑> OK 啦 ，Take care 啊 ，Take care，Take care。So 啊、uh, ，Let's go back to social 啊啊，汉林啊 ，If those of you are studying history 啊、uh, ，In fact。Political, economic, and social. Social is the one. You see, first of all, uh, Han Ling, I don't know whether you agree with me. Because the German was already unemployed, the Wilma government was like shit, and then all the depression come in. So a hungry man is an angry man. So if you don't win the people, the hearts of people of the 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 whole entire uh, citizens in Germany, you cannot win the war. Because okay, because but, of okay, the... okay, wait, wait, wait. I like to point out the fact that we can all agree on the fact that from thirty two to thirty seven. Was a social reform, but from 30, 30, uh, yeah, they got the 38 hours is not, they got 30, the 40 38 hours is not a social reform. That is, no, that is, you already that is, say, what? you already say starting is a social review. Yes. You get it? The start is a social, yes. You mean for male social, now right? you're economic and political, brother. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> 因为他们 social 全部是 the Wilma government, sorry, the Nazis, the third right. And then they voted for Hitler because Hitler pushed of the orator skills, movements, and then the my, my craft, my struggles books in the, in the prison. And then you tell the people to overthrow the Wilma governments, to overthrow the, the Jews, and to bring out the news, the, 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 the rise of the Iron's uh, families, the, 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 the group, the race. You see, that's why people can kind of pin me. You don't have all these people to pin in the real world, Mao Zedong is young, all the people. Sun Zhong San is young, Gai Germing. Chemo to the social, from the lowest bottom to the highest. Pussy Swan, you saw, Hanley, Pussy Swan, you saw, Ni, you need the comfort, what you were the comfort. So, uh, gentlemen, we are talking about how the social transformation can restructure the life of the people. So, you look at social study, why you call social study? Why you don't call economic study? Or political study. There is a reason for that. So social study is really talking about the world and the people who contribute not the mushroom theory but the different levels to ensure, enhance and enable the people to vote for the right governments, to bring them out of poverty, out of unemployment, out of um, um, without housing and that is the most, most basic needs. So when you're writing this kind of essay in your A-level, in your poly, in your university or even your argumentative essay, you have to mention all this one. That's the reason. Because the, the, the one that shine out among the social group of people is the road rose among the thorns. That, yeah, I can bring you out of this uh, shit. I can bring you out of this um, disaster, disastrous world nightmare. Follow me. I will bring you. So same thing as Stalin. <clears throat> Stalin started off with collectivizations. It's also food agriculture, then industrializations. You need to settle the people, the heart first. Okay, you have to center their mind first. Then they can help you to win. Han Ling, if one day you can, you you really can. I believe you can. You can help your wife to open a business. You first have to find the right people to help you. You can't go 24 hours with your wife to run because you're in pain. So yeah, you see, you no know, one. By the time I can use AI, AI is also social, also management. People have to build these machines for you, ah, right? You also have to use people to communicate with people. You also have to use people to communicate with people. You also have to use people to communicate with people. You also have to use people to communicate with people. You also have to use people to communicate with people. You also have to use people to communicate with people. Uh, you agree with me, honey? Why, why you don't answer me already, honey? Or well, angry already, say, can you see? You're angry already. You point finger at me already, you don't answer me already. Okay, Lord, you don't answer what you're saying. Can you, can you hear me, honey? Or you're really angry? Ah? Ah, I talk so much, you never answer me. I'm so disappointed. Let's move on. Increased, uh, uh, can you, are you able to read now? Okay, okay. Increased, okay. Increased diversity and inclusion. Social change that promotes diversity and inclusion can lead to increased innovation and creativity, which can drive economic growth. Yeah, when stop, individual stop, from stop, diver stop, stop, you see? So this already tell you, Han Ling was saying that, no, the social is not important. It's the economy that drives the people. I mean, if you don't have these people who are smart people, like the professor, the engineers, the doctors, the, the, the architects, the scientists, how can you go? 
So when you're writing this kind of essay, please think, whether is it political, economy, or social? Yeah, of course, you need a good political leaders. No need to say that. Uh, it's very straightforward. Just like Mr. Lee Kuan Yew, Mr. Xi Jinping, uh, you, want, you want to talk about Donald Trump, but we need anybody. Let's go. Han Ling, are you still there? One, two, three. No, let's go. When? When oh, individual oh, from oh, diverse. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Han Ling, are you still there? Yeah, I am, I am, I am. I couldn't find the unmute button. Oh, so do you agree what I say just now? Did you hear what I say just now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, no, I, I agree. I agree. I mean, there's no much of a standpoint to debate when most of it is facts. Uh. I think the only debatable thing is at what point was it changed from a social reform to an industrial reform? Because Everyone the people support about. the government. That's yeah, right. But, yeah, but the people's support can be only up to like 34. Because... Mm. Like, okay, okay, 34, that Hindenburg dies, right? So it's yeah. not really support the government, it's support Hitler. And then, like, yeah. 35 hours, it's forced to support Hitler instead of voluntarily yeah. support Hitler. So, to push out the That one's up to you. Yeah. Okay. So you see, you got your own arguments, I got my own arguments, but whichever way is still not wrong, but you have the right point. As long as you got the evidence to support your arguments, it's still. Uh, reasonable, debatable, uh, acceptable. All right. Thank you, Han Ling. Uh, good. Uh, this we can use as history as a platform. I think uh, Kang Yao, you also do history, right? So we can use this as a platform. Uh, sadly to say, today uh, I was so free. I went to Popular to spend 50 minutes, nearly one hour, sitting, you not know, sitting, walking through the history section. Uh, and I read through the textbook. Uh, uh, Han Ling, uh, are you doing now the Vietnam and Indonesia already? We're doing Vietnam only. Vietnam after is the collapse of the Soviet Union and that's it. Do you do Indonesia, the no. Hindu or Malaya? No. no, no. In your textbook, do does the they have Indonesia? No, no, only, no, no. only Vietnam. Only Vietnam. The start of the Vietnam War. The whole Vietnam War actually. The the the, the pre and post. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, okay. That is interesting. Because when I look at the text, the guidebook, it doesn't say much on that. Okay, so uh, very interesting. Uh, if you do Vietnam, is it very dry for Vietnam? We, we just started, so I don't really have an opinion on it yet. Well, let me know. Uh. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, because if you want to know more about Vietnam, you're going to watch the movie called We Were Soldiers. Okay, you will know the whole, how they work. Okay, let's go, uh, can you? When individuals from diverse backgrounds are included in the workforce, they bring unique. Screw now. Wait, wait, wait. My mouse. Hey, okay. Backgrounds. Background. Uh, wait, no. I start with they bring, they bring unique perspective and ideas that can lead to development of a new of new products and services and service. <laughs> No need to say, ah. Uh. Okay, number two. Improve education and train and skill training. Social change that prioritizes education and skill training can lead to a more skilled, uh, workforce, which can drive economic growth. When individuals are trained in new skills or, or educated, uh, emerging technologies. They can feel high demand jobs and contribute to the growth of, in this new industries. No, no. They can feel high demand. Or they can feel yeah, high demand jobs and contribute to the growth of new industries. So you see, uh, if it's still back to social, you need talented people. That's why Germans, Germany, Hitler, <coughs> get the best breeds of the Germans to run the country for him and to bring out the, the, the economic powers. So that's how I feel. And by the way, next one will be uh, Kang Yao. Uh, sorry, Kang Yao. Uh, when did the when did the doctor say that you can fully recover for how long? Uh, the doctor haven't said anything yet, but I'll be going for physiotherapy. Huh? Doctor haven't said anything. Haven't said anything. Yeah, talking about grand eagles, they don't tell you anything. No, they haven't said anything. Huh? No, they never tell you it's one month, two months, that kind of thing. No. Oh my God! Seriously. No. I'm very surprised. Okay, I'm seriously very surprised. So it's not a very serious injury, is it? Or, or what? Uh, 
it's not as serious as we thought, but it's just that uh, it just got blood clot. So it, it's just that my whole left leg was very swollen. So that means it released the blood clot, right? Did they inject some things to release the blood clot? Uh, they like medication. They two cm incision to squeeze out the blood. Two what? Two cm incision. Oh my god! You cut lah. Yeah. So you put you in sleep ah? No, no, no. Then. Uh, anesthesia. You just put two, yeah, two syringes of uh anesthesia and just uh, do it. Then after that, you feel the pain. Uh. No, after that, it's, it's not it's not a painful. Ah, we are five No pain, no gain. Ah, must take it. Do ma. No, uh, it's anesthesia. They don't feel pain during anesthesia, sure. Of course, I mean after that, ma, ma, three, four, four, you think we pain the ma? Correct, no? <laughs> Okay, okay. But that time when I saw you at the video, I thought you fracture or at your ankle. No, no, it's not fracture it. The, because the doctor scared that I tore my ACL, like partially there because he cannot feel it. He cannot feel it because it's so swollen. So he put a cast in case I, I don't uh, tear it any, any further. True, true. Protection is better. Uh, prevention is better. Thank you. So he still has to make sure. So the cast was one or two days already? The cast was uh, last Sunday. Oh, a few days ah? Uh? Yeah. But they also cut away the blood clot on before they put the cast on, is it? When when they're squeezing out, uh, there's there wasn't much blood that came out. A lot. No, not that much. But it's all it's all the blood, is it? Uh, I I I just saw he he was blocking, but he, my the doctor and my mom say it, there wasn't that much blood that came out. Oh. Okay, so be careful now because now your left leg is already like ninety eight percent to ninety five percent. Even when you recover, uh, you must take note. Uh. And then when you have this, uh, please take note. When you go for national service, uh, please tell them you got injury before. Huh? Okay? You have to get this record and tell them you got injury before. Okay. Ask, ask the doctor to write. Okay? Because uh, I'm telling you, uh, if you go to commando because you don't wear spec, uh, if you go for commando or guards, uh, you're going to airborne, jump, 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 jump. I can tell you, good luck to you. Uh. <laughs> Then if you go to armor, you also jump, 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 run, run, uh, was all kind of obstacles. Uh. So you better tell them you got this injury. Uh. Even though now it's yeah, 15, uh, in three to four years' time, how long you recover? Sometimes the old sickness and old injury can come back. Okay, okay. so I just I just remember that. Anyway, we are, I'll catch up with you later that before the end of the lesson. <coughs> Number three, please, Kang Yao. Uh, increased intern in entrepreneurship social change that promotes uh entrepreneurship can lead to the creation of new businesses and industries which can drive economic growth when individuals are encouraged and supported to in starting their own uh, businesses they can create jobs contribute to their local economy economies and spur innovation all of you, can you please highlight this, the word spur innovations, please? Write down somewhere. The word spur, if the, the spur means is to create, to, uh, to bring up the motivation and inspiration. So that, that this word spur is very good words to you, uh, to use in your say whatever. See. So you realize this number three tell you, uh, businessmen like you yourself next time also will be using like your dad, okay, or your daddy here, okay? They might not necessarily be a businessman or they can be a businessman or are they are already in the business as a businessman. They will find many ways, number one, to be profitable, survival, and the most important. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. I, I know. I, I want to use the Tottenham Hotspur. Uh, Zach, thanks. Okay, but uh, very sad for zero. Uh. <laughs> okay, never mind. Thanks, bro. <laughs> I agree. High, high five to you and keep the chain high six. Uh yeah, Doctor Hotspur. Yeah, that is the how we spur the, the rooster. Anyway, um, you realize your daddy with all these expertise, they are, they want to make the company their job more profitable, uh, more survival and more um durable, and more lasting in their job. They have to spur innovations. They need to create a lot of uh, ideas and creativities to continuity for their business and their career. 
the career will be up skills, right? That's like uh, Kang Yao. This morning, your mommy called me. She was attending a class, right? Yeah, see? Wow, still continue. Wow, 真的佩服她。我倒是真的,哇,活到老学到了。哇,我不可以输给她。我要去找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,找,
social safety nets and civic engagement can lead to economic growth by creating a more skilled uh, in, 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 innovative. in innovative and engaged workforce, promoting the creation of new businesses and industries and building stronger and more stable communities. Exactly. Thank you very much. Have you, what you meant here is that this conclusion is true. The word diversity, you know, in issue two, we talk about diversity. Everything is about education, to educate the public, to educate the, the population in order to make it better, make it more uh, professional, make it more well-versed, well-maintained, well-self-love, self-discipline, self-achievement. For Singapore, the city-state, you can see this part here. <clears throat> this is where? Uh, well, this is... Uh, Singapore is so small, it could fit inside California. Oh my goodness. You can see it's very insulting. Eh? Uh, honey, do you think? Uh, can you? Zach, Kang Yang, do you think it's very insulting? I feel that it's very insulting. It's like Honestly, so small. In what my do... uh, in my humble, honest opinion, not really. Huh? I mean, everyone has to accept their, their like, their, their, their shortcomings. Uh. Yeah, but you know, in purposely, it's a 575 times then. Well, the way he put 575 times to represent California this week. Saying that you are useless, are so big, you also cannot fight with my small little dog here. My GDP I mean, is higher okay, than no, no, GDP. Sure, sure. If they are bad, whose problem is it? Our problem or their problem? Yeah, that's like, oh. Their problem, not my problem. Exactly. Uh, much, uh, yeah, their problem. So this person, you see, ah, uh, we can CNN, eh? by the way, it's CNN. Eh? <clears throat> oh, it's CNN? Friendly yeah. Fire. Zach, can you restart your laptop? Straight up, Friendly Fire. Uh, so is it biased or neutral? It, it, I mean, if you criticize yourself, how, how there's no way it's either, right? It's just self-inflicted damage, you know? Yeah, and then you say 56 square kilometers, the equivalent of the 6,000 football pitches of extra land that Singapore plans to reclaim from the sea by 2030 due to an ever expanding population and cityscape. Wow, well, look at seven. Uh. Qatar is number one. World economic GDP. Qatar no. A country is near the desert in the in the in the Sahara Desert that area. <clears throat> China is only this. Uh. Are you sure or not? I don't believe it. They, they put China as this. What I mean world GDP per world ranking? Are you so bad? <clears throat> uh, I don't against, know. The, against the world right now, China's GDP isn't as high as most people expect. Yeah, but this is a bit biased, eh? Now, breakdown of economy. So maybe your, so this to, one. Uh, this... So, 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 you, have, you have to keep in mind GDP is represented by how much it is compared to like other countries as of now. And as of now, compared to like richer countries like Luxembourg, uh, oh, Finland, uh, it's, it's, yeah. it's, it's, it's still relatively not on the high side as of now. As for well. China? Yeah, for, for China, compared to like countries like I'm Luxembourg, surprised, eh? things like that. I mean, I mean, obviously, they're not as rich as like Swiss, Swiss Luxembourg, they're all. Yeah, okay, but not, not to the 122 position. Eh? No, no. If you say top 50, I still can accept. Uh. But 122, eh? I mean, it depends on who's making the list. If yeah, nah, if, CNN, if, no. it's a, if it's okay, it's CNN kind of kind of obvious why they're so low. Ah, uh, it's CNN, no? You see, I told you guys every uh, country wants others, their uh, own news outlets to be able to like spread its yes. own, like, message, you know? Yeah, for, for the benefit of the country. So it's ne so it's never going to be beneficial towards both parties, or so it's completely factual. True. It, sometimes, sometimes it is, sometimes it's not. It depends on the news outlet, as always. So you see on the four corners, I straight away I've spotted this corner here, you see? So breakdown of economy, yeah, well, this is, okay, what they have in Singapore. 19% is manufacturing, but now the manufacturing in Singapore is closing down one by one. Too expensive to have a manufacturing in Singapore. <clears throat> Zach, can you still hear me? Zachary, can you still hear me? 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, okay. So Changi Airport was uh, one of the worst best in at the World Airport Awards. Whoa. 51.1 billion passengers. Yeah, is, is the best. We take pride in our airport. Is the yeah, best. Uh, count you money out. After 15 years later, I think we step down. It's your turn to take over already. I mean, only 15 years, uh, 10 years later. Uh. 
by the time 10 years later, uh, you're still a green horn. Uh. Maybe start to build up. Uh, maybe uh, maybe 20 years. Uh, 15 years enough. Uh, 15 years. 15 years cannot. Yeah, 15 years, not 10 years. Maybe in 15 years time, just count the members here, leaders, to continue to maintain. Can you imagine when you reach your hands, uh, as Changi Airport become number seven, number eight, oh. Oh, that, yeah. that, that, would be, that would be a bit embarrassing, isn't it? Uh, it's under your leadership already, you know, bro. Correct, no? You need it. That's true. It's, uh, Lee Kuan Yew started maintaining that we, we, with that time, the only that time when we joined was during COVID. Eh? Uh, so this one also can help you in your economy. So writing your essay, using this statistic, you can tell, you see, port, you see 24, you see. But I heard now uh, China also want to cut across the Thai border. Uh, but with the Thai and Malaysia border, and so that you will bypass Singapore, but they were still thinking, but that the project will be well billions and billions of dollars. Is it possible? I I don't think possible for the next twenty years, in my opinions. Maybe in the near future, it's possible. It's possible, but if they are cutting, might be deeper cutting already. Maybe they don't cut. Maybe the Malaysia and Thai border, Thailand border. So yeah, this is the makeup of so like Mandarin, English, Malay, Hokkien, Cantonese, Teochew, Tamil, others, Chinese dialects and others. You realize in Singapore, the majorities are Hokkien, Fujianhua, Guangdonghua, and Chaozhou. I'm from the Teochew, uh, Chaozhou Ren. But they still have Hainan Ren, Fu, Fu, uh, uh, Xinhua Ren, uh, and uh, Fuzhou Ren. Wow, many different dialects. I'm trying to go. China has a lot of dialects. Anyway, this picture tells you the you see, Singapore may be one of the worst tiniest nations, but its small stretch uh, structure has hasn't stopped it from becoming one of East Asia most powerful trading hubs. And it is true that Singapore historical status as a trading hub is reflected in the ethnic diversity of the populations and the numbers of official language recognized within the city state. Wow. How come uh, you can? Oh, no, I'm not sure. Kang Yao, Zachary, uh, Han Li, and you. Imagine I say this sentence. Uh, Hello, Abang. Sulamakan. How are you? Ni Chi Ting, how ma? Balakam. You understand what I'm saying? Anyone? Anyone know? I mix with Malay, Chinese, and Indian. Got fun or not? Got to fun or not? How are you? That's the only thing you know. Uh. How about the Malay? Wait, I, I didn't exactly catch what you said in full. Hello, Abang. Sudah makan? Ni se pada ma? Pirai uyang. Banakam. Yin le da. I forgot what Banakam is actually. Banakam is uh, greeting to you. Good afternoon, good evening. Banakam. Oh. Uh, yin le in Tamil is mean mei yu liao, wan liao. Habis. Habis is wan tan liao. Mei yu liao. So you see, uh, okay. this is local, yeah. As English, eh? Are you sure, leh? Excuse me, huh? I tell you, don't play, play, huh? I see, you heard the word, don't play, play. Just say, huh? What play, what play, play, what play football, play basketball, play badminton, play what? The word, don't play, 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 don't play, 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 don't joke with me. Don't mess around with me. So this is the local flavor of Singlish. Well, that is makes us different. We have so-called a sense of belonging. A sense of social status, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> okay, let's move on. Okay, so this is a uh, questions that later you all need to do. Okay, let's go on to read this one first. Um, what is the difference between economic sustainability and social sustainability? If social sustainability focuses on improving social equalities, economic sustainability aims to improve the standard of living. Well, right now, this is very true. It's going to be very powerful statements in your social studies. Okay, uh, Zach, you should know, uh, in the context of business, it refers to the efficient use of assets to maintain company profitability over time. So social equality <coughs> is to focus by social sustainability. Economy sustainability is in <coughs> to improve the standard of living. Well, I cannot read it. Uh, Zach, are you able to read <laughs> Yeah, are you able to read? Hello? I can't hear you. You want to restart your computer again? Okay? Let's do it. Because you got problem hearing, uh, then you feel very frustrated. Uh. 
<laughs> you can restart your computer. So I open the door. Okay, never mind. Can you carry me to the class, please? <laughs> there, I can't hear you. Can you, are you? Harry, which one? Which one? <laughs> Okay. One of the longest ongoing debates in the modern world involves sustainability and how it can be integrated into economic and social aspects of society. There is no doubt that sustainability plays a crucial role in the restoration of the planet and the survival of living beings. Rapid in the in the rise like industrialization. In, in the, okay. Industrialization is putting undue pressure on our planet's resources. And decision makers across the globe need to take care, take immediate action if they wish to restore the planet. That means global warming, lah. So do something. So you see, so social sustainability is to what the keyword is what social equality. Let's go. Wow. <coughs> Suddenly, feel chest pain. Can you carry on? <coughs> I'm sorry, guys. Really bad. Uh, can you can you carry on, please? All right. Even. Even nations, and businesses are that are simply concerned with achieving economic growth must acknowledge that the sustainability of business depends on the planet's natural resources such as clean water, fertile land, and a diverse without, population. Without. Oh. Fertile land and diverse. and a diverse population. In light of this, let's examine the subject of economic sustainability and look at some change provoking examples of economic sustainability. So even the nations itself, they are looking into ways to see how um they really achieve economic goals is to make sure sustainable. <laughs> Give me a minute. It's a full cup. My back cup. Full cup. Stop. No, no, no. I want the best. All right. Sorry, guys. I get my wife to give me my medicine. So, you see, every nation or every country, in order to have economic achievement, first of all, you must have sustainability in terms of like make sure the planet is well, the environment is clean, the people are healthy so that you can move on. If not, how can you change, right? So what is economic sustainability? Uh, Zach, are you able to read now? I can't hear you, I can't hear you, never mind. We really can't hear you, it's okay. I don't want to waste the time. Uh, can you don't mind? What is economic sustainability? David, to the class, please. Unmute your mic. Can you help? Uh, economic susten sustainability describes actions that support a company's or country's long-term economic growth, which simultaneously... Simultaneously. Simultaneously. Uh, simultaneously, preserving the environment, society, and culture. Despite a uh, generally shared understanding of the types of business practices such as the use of harmful manufacturing techniques to production of food waste and burning of fossil fuels that contribute to climate change. Uh, very few organizations today are successful in achieving economic sustainability. You agree? Whatever you're using now at home is burning a lot of fossil fuels. Sorry, I'm taking my medicine, Fumo Seal. Give me a while, bro. See, no matter how it is, uh, uh, gentlemen, the moment we turn on our gas cooker, our electricity, our TV, or even drive our car, 
even we take our bus, anything we really start to so-called harm the environment. Unless you take bicycle, but before you take the bicycle, the manufacturing of the bicycle also come from manufacturing company plants. So no matter how, oh no, you switch off my Wi-Fi. Can you switch off my Wi-Fi? Oh, thank God. So no matter how, this, you see, in order to have economic sustainability, you must balance. You must make sure that when you're burning here, you also must put more trees or something like that, okay? To balance it. Okay, let's move on. Uh, the next paragraph, can you have mind? The goal of economic sustainability is to achieve economic growth without making the negative environmental trade-offs that traditionally go hand-in-hand -hand with growth. Economic sustainability is a broad collection of decision-making principles and corporate practices. Exactly, the Kaito uh, com Conference, the, the Paris Conference, conference. these are all talking about green plan. Uh, 2030, Singapore governments are also talking about green plan, making sure that we are going for EV car, uh, less of burning of fossil fuels. Not possible, uh, guys. Very hard. If this do that, all the petroleum companies, or those who do with petroleum will be the gas and oil, they will die flat. They put, a lot of people get retrenched. And it, it might create another war. I feel it. Up. Not just an economic war. I feel it. There will be more than that. In my opinion. So, so well, very tricky uh, to see how are we going to save the environment. At the same time, we have economic sustainability and social, sus social sustainability. Okay, so you have to balance. So this essay talk about, well, if you want both economy and social, then you must look into environmental. So it's a tree, it's a triangle, okay? So you have to look into this way. Uh, thank you very much. Next paragraph, please, Daniel. Thank you. When? When it comes to environmental impact, the truth regarding the damage caused by the global business community is harsh. They are one of the worst contributors to the abuse of natural resources and carbon emissions by not prioritizing 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 by not prioritizing environmental sustainability businesses around the world are contributing to the negative environmental impact so how so they say that damage of global the global business is the one <clears throat> we are talking about Nike, Starbucks, Dell, Lenovo, Lurking, Adidas. All these companies are all worldwide. They have to travel, fly here, fly there, ship here, ship there, or even Lazada, Shopee, even Amazon. So, you know, they, they travel and then they have to burn all the fossil fuel. They are the global business. They are the one who has the biggest impact. It's not a small company, right? So that's why it meant here. So how are we going to prioritize the environment? Which one is the most important? How can we help the business grow at the same time to protect the environments? Next paragraph, please. Anya. Generally speaking, businesses which make use of the cheapest uh, manufacturing technology have the worst environmental impact. One example of this fast fashion and single-use plastic this is due to the fact that increasing costs to the environment do not result in higher pricing for consumers. This is understandable given that companies are rarely required to cover the full cost of the environmental damage the operations generate. So we are talking about maybe the device jeans or some of the shirt that Uniqlo make. <clears throat> do they really manufacture in Japan but it's very expensive right? the labor cost? Or are they sending to a third world country to manufacture it? And then uh, they use their very, uh, not very high tech machines or maybe their labor cost. Instead of using electrical sewing machines, they are using very manual manpower to do it, painstakingly to do it and to sew up the shirt. I don't know. I'm just giving a wild guess. So does it really help? At the same time, we increase the employment rate in the underdeveloped country and developing country. But on the other hand, you know, they are cutting down trees to build factories for these people to get accommodate to do the manufacturing. Well, it's a chicken and egg. Huh? So you look at this 
picture here, it says the linear economy is straight to that. Recycling economy, you can see it going round, 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 and come up to this. And then circular economy is like, like this, going round, but does it really go back to here? Is it which one? I'm, I'm not sure which is good, but uh, to me, I find that circular economy has its own advantages like helping to do it again, to like recycling, but maybe go back. But sometimes, do you really want to use the old thing? I'm not sure. Thank you. Uh, Zach, do one more time, see whether you can hear me, can we? Well, your PLD is very bad. I really can't hear you. That bad, sure it is. I think you better make sure your Wi-Fi and your mic is working on Thursday and Friday. Right, so do some setup. Maybe it's uh, like what thing you did was telling me that it's got to do with the update of the software. Hali, next one. What are the benefits? What are the benefits of economic responses? Sustainability. The benefits of economic sustainability are numerous. They're not only beneficial for the planet, but they can also help the business increase their revenue and stay profitable for the long term. There are many reasons why sustainable economy is important. From corporate interest to idealistic environmentalism, here are some of its benefits. The sustainability uh, of the well, global... So, uh, what you are reading, uh, Han, Han Lin, is that... <clears throat> excuse me. They are not only benefit to the planet, but also the business. So, how are they going to stay... The keyword is, how are they going to stay to survive, to have profit, or to have uh, employability for their staff? Let's hear it. Number one. The, one, sustain the sustainability of the global economy. Since the planet's natural resources are finite, the reliance on unsustainable methods must come to end. Any commercial enterprise that wants to last the long haul needs to invest in new resources and develop new procedures of production. The preservation of human life. The exploitation of fossil fuels has accelerated the catastrophic situation facing Earth and human habitation. Humans have the chance to protect Earth for future generations by making efforts to reduce energy usage and change how businesses operate. Innovative breakthroughs, innovative and discovery, innovation and discovery have historically come from the natural world. Therefore, the chance to discover novel substances and processes that can form the basis of new goods or other economic advantages is threatened by the ongoing destruction of the natural environment. When the Industrial Revolution started in 1800s, the 1900s, men realized that fossil fuel was one of the best energy to start off using, to use that to, to, to pump up the, 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 the railway, the aeroplanes, the car, all the vehicles to make transport more convenient, faster, and more efficient. At a very big price to pay for it by depleting the ozone layer, destroying the environments, and digging a lot of holes here in the sea at, at the risk of everybody. Oh my goodness. So, you look at it. Is it worthwhile? Is it the price that you guys, the next generation, is going to take over and see? Is it using solar panel, wind power, and water power, this three energy? Will it help to be better than to the environment to the next generations? <clears throat> Let me see, is this the last paragraph that I'm talking about here? Oh no, we still got a bit more, right? Okay, last one. Good. Uh, Hanin, can you finish these two paragraphs? Thank you. <coughs> Some examples of economic sustainability in practice. Fortunately, there are many real-life examples of economic sustainability practices emerging globally. Businesses and global governmental organizations in some situations are enhancing their sustainability procedures to lower their carbon footprint. While this is going on, innovative businesses are producing goods or technology that help the environment in one way or another. Some people have even adopted economic sustainability principles at the expense of minimal growth. Bro, this one is too much. Expenses of minimal growth and with the others. So <clears throat> are you saying the richest country will get riches, the poorer will continue to just to help the rich to get even riches? Or what? Are they on the same path? Or are they going to share their innovative ideas with the developed and underdeveloping country? Okay, Tara, Odo? Sure, give me a sec. 
Okay, then I continue. Huh? Adobe... No, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. I was just, I was just turning up the volume or something. Oh, okay. Although there's still a long way to go for the world to reach true economic sustainability, these real life examples can serve as a catalyst for change in organization of all kinds as well as among individuals. The most intriguing example of economic sustainability is a new gadget that can draw water out of the air. Many businesses have created or are developing these kind of inventions. These kinds of systems demonstrate economic sustainability in action by offering the manufacturer financial rewards while also having a significant positive impact on the environment, such as reliable access to clean water, which 2.2 billion people around the world do not have, and significantly reduce plastic usage. Wow, funding. <clears throat> if you are a scientist, you can turn the ocean water into a very clean water and 100% pure drinkable water to develop countries like Africa or, or some of other countries. Well, I tell you, 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 you save a lot of people, billions of people, especially people in India. Seriously, they are really, I don't know why, the rich are super rich. Really super rich. The poor are damn super poor living in the slum, living in the drainage, living in the on top of all the rubbish. Power up. Can sleep there and eat there and shit there and drink there and bathe there and, and, and urine there. Oh my god, seriously. You get skin cancer, man. But they don't care. But what to do? They are uneducated. Ah you what thing ah? What thing? Carry on this one. Uh, one of the best methods are uh, tenure. Yes, tenure, one of the best methods to lessen. One of the best methods to lessen your carbon impact is through recycling. Today, a wide range of businesses have turned to recycle or its cousin, upcycling, downcycling, e-cycling, pre and pre-cycling as a source of revenue. Many businesses have also committed to producing minimal to zero wastage in their production. Okay, thanks. I was swallowing my saliva. Thanks. Uh, this paragraph tells you that you say uh, recycling is the way to go. Especially, I like the way you use the word cousin, upcycle, downcycle, e-cycle, and recycle. So these are their cousins. I wouldn't say they are cousins. I say that they are brothers. Related in order, you see. So uh, in today's recycling help a lot of socials, uh, help, as in, help a lot of economics. I don't know, let's start first. Uh, in terms of recycling business, it help to have a strong impact on social, definitely, to make their life better because they can use this recycle to sell. You can see those auntie, uncle, they'll smash their can and then use the can to sell to the recycling company to earn some money. And some they collect cut box for recycling or even newspaper. And recycling also has moves up the economy in terms of new uh, new businesses, which is good. And in terms of environments, definitely it protects the environments from getting more harm. So this business is actually one stone kill three birds. Uh, you think about it. Okay. Let's go. Uh can you nearly? Nearly one third of the world fisheries are currently in danger of extinction due to overfishing, overfishing, which is wreaking havoc on our oceans. The good news is that the fish fish producers are able to switch to a more com comically viable strategy because of the technology for fish is farming is commercially. Or commercially viable strategy because the technology for fish farming is gradually improving. Consider. Consider filtering and reusing wastewater as as well as processing fish waste and using it as a premium fertilizer. Can you remember last week I show you you show us the the the, girl, the guy who eat the raw fish, right? Oh, I know the. Yeah, yeah, I saw the picture. So oh my goodness, I said right. raw fish. Huh? How can the bloody raw fish? Remember we talk about parasite, huh? the parasite eating, and then the parasite sitting in the fish. And, and they start to balloon it into the whole wow, the, the immune system of a man. And funny, uh, the best thing is that they only attack hand and the leg, uh, but not other parts of the body. Uh. Funny, uh, the parasite know how to choose where to attack. Luckily, it never attack the heart. Uh. Imagine it attack the heart, the kidney, the lung, the liver, the stomach. That's it, man. Wow, it's excruciating pain. So, yeah. 
That's why it means sometimes the water get polluted. We eat the deep fish, polluted fish. All of this carry on. Oh, these are great examples of how economic sustainability can be applied to traditional businesses to make them more sustainable and even more profitable. Okay. Last paragraph. Oh, the, which one? The sustainability, Anna? Yeah. Okay, sustainability and Shenado Shen 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 Electric go hand in hand. It has been well and will remain the foundation of everything we do. In just 15 years, we have helped our client reduce their carbon footprint by 120 million tons while increase, also increasing global energy access by 330 million. At Shenido, Shenido Electric, Schneider, Schneider Electric. Schneider Electric, we are fully committed to ensuring that our clients are making the most of our uh, uh, of their trust of uh, their sustainability initiatives. We have set out on our own Shesnaya Electric Pledge, under which we'll be the uh, will be carbon neutral in the operations by twenty fifteen and and end to end by twenty fourteen or oh, twenty twenty five. So you see this essay was written or this this uh, report or this um, um passage was written by these people who say that in order to make sure that uh social economy see the question is which one okay so I managed to get this article from this person okay Schneider Electric who are uh, so uh, as fast as we have done this so far, we got 30 minutes to go. I seriously would like you to use this word. Take a picture. So... <coughs> Can you send to the group now? Wait. <coughs> wait, 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 wait. Okay. Wait, wait. Oh, sorry. Wait, then. Okay. Yeah, sent it. Then uh this one social responding person economy which is more important. So you got two essay, yeah. Social economy, okay. This one. Kanya, which one do you think is important? Social or economic? We, we know. Uh, no. I think economic sustainability is more important one more time which one do you say sorry uh economic sustainability okay meanwhile i want you to spend 15 minutes the four of you <clears throat> to submit this essay now oh so come here which one do you want to do so can you please describe three values <coughs> funding also is that so kind of which one you want to do this one or this one or this uh, one argumentative sorry i'll give me a minute i delete this okay correct ah correct this one ah. okay so i want you to spend a couple of minutes now please do not write in essay form i want you to introductions like for example can you uh, you can put that intro Okay, just say a few things and then paragraph one. In point form, like in other words, in point form, okay? And paragraph two, paragraph three, and then conclusion. All of you do the same now. No need to write, I say, a few sentences if, just to give you ideas, then make it as a homework. All right, let's do it now. Damn it, why you can't join it? Yes. yes. Okay, like that, huh? Okay. I want you all to write and then send it to me. If you can, one shot, like one shot, send like that. So you can have a three sentence like using AIMS and then using close.
So what does close stand for? Close is here. Okay. Okay, close is here. Okay, I'm going to get some water to the cell. Anyone still doing that? So it's an essay. No need essay in a point form. The essay is this oh, one. Point form? Yeah, I want I want essay for this one. I want I essay have, for I've this got, one. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I, I want essay for this one. I want the essay for this one. But this one, point form. Da, 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 da. Okay, thank you, Kang Yao. Hey, this one is intro, huh? Thank you, Kang Yao. Yeah, yes. Okay, so this is an intro. Check and go on a bit.
Thank you, Ali. Thank you, Amira. This time for me uh, to see, uh, this for parents to see. Uh. Parents has been asking uh, where y'all do full mode, not, not just this class, uh, everyone. Oh, seriously, man, Zach, nostalgia. Ooh. So romantic. Uh. Now, that one will be happen to you, uh, 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 Zach. When you have your Xiao Wu, uh, you and your wife starting, you know, got married and then. Uh, then you start to enjoy just like me when I was Uncle Raymond now, uh, me and my wife would be wow, you know, suddenly free from mommy, daddy, uh, or all on your own. Uh, wow, I want to break free that time. Yeah, use fist pop. Thank you very much. Use fist pop. Please do so, right? Use fist pop. Hey, uh Kang Yao, you got two paragraphs. Uh? Paragraph one and paragraph one. So what? Is it paragraph two? No, no, uh paragraph one, I got something to add. No need so long, but okay, can, can. Uh, so you add this one, huh? Yeah. Okay. Uh, continue from the him to spend, huh? Yeah. Like that, right? Is it like that? Yeah. Oh, okay, thanks. Hello, can you? Where is your answer? Everyone give answer really there. I said you that can you? Brother, are you doing something or brother? Mr. Tian Yu. Whoa. Should I put all in one gun for Whoa. the Zoom got Zoom got the, 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 what's that, the limit? Yeah, how do you know? Oh, steady, yeah, brother. So I have to cut and paste for. Well done, brother. Okay, now paragraph three. I thought I cannot go out there. Hmm. Ah, okay, like that. Okay, this Thursday is the last lesson for this month. So all of you must complete your essay for me.
So let's just say I might have written this question a little before, so I know what I'm doing. I don't care, Hale. Yeah, exactly. The best. You know my style. Don't I don't care. Tell. This is not your school, man. This is not the school. This is my our school, <sighs> your school. Your school train of thoughts. Right? We are talking about the school of society, man. You should know me by now very well, bro. Free flow. On time, on target. Carry on. Hello, brother. This is what? Honey. You send with you, right? Yeah, that's paragraph one, sir. You sent paragraph one to me already, what? No, no, that, that, oh, that was intro. That was intro. This is paragraph one. Planning for the future. But you, you put that planning for the future, they already have what? Bro. Wait. You look at the, this one, planning for the future of life. Then what? Second paragraph also planning for the future, man. Okay, I don't know. Yeah, 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 it is, it is, it is. It is. There's no mistake, there's no mistake. Okay, 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 okay. okay, 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 okay. Okay, paragraph two. What the heck, man? Well, a bit, a bit funny, yeah. Huh? Okay, the alignment is a bit different. I'm so sorry. Paragraph three. So is this is the way to help you to practice for your. Real exam. Conclusion. Okay. Uh, thank you. Can you? Okay, thanks. You have complete. <laughs> you have say with it. This is paragraph three. Okay. Eh? Kang Yang, is the paragraph two? Oh, oh, okay. Sorry, 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 sorry. Uh -oh. oh, my God. Oh, my Jesus. Okay, paragraph three is this one from Kang Yang. Oh, sorry, you still have the note there. Oops, the return. It's a yes there. Give me a minute, I'm aligning the big things. Mm, do, 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 do. Oh, 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 you passed, you passed. Okay, conclusion. So we left Zach and uh, Han Ling. Han Ling is a uh, paragraph two and, two and three conclusions. Well, Zach, we're gonna have P, P1, two, three and conclusions. The longer you take, I cannot end my class. So do your best to finish it. So we left conclusion for you, Kang Yao. Uh, Tian Yu, you can shake leg ready. Uh. Relax and look and read. Uh. If you want, you can read their, their story. Uh. So this is what? Paragraph two or three. Tian Yu, honey. Paragraph two. Paragraph two, huh? Okay. Hey, wait, wait. All this point form is which one? You must, can you read, read, tell me all this is paragraph one, two, or three? How's that? 
Can you please tell me home is paragraph two, paragraph three, paragraph what? Can you write down in this way? Retype for me because I will put all this whole thing. Uh, all this paragraph two. Uh. Oh, okay. Where's your paragraph one? I didn't see your paragraph one, bro. You only got introductions there. Eh? Your, where's your paragraph one? Ah, uh, I thought intro was no then. Intro is intro. Paragraph one is you go straight to the ideas really. Lucky I see. Hey, where's your where's your Kanyo? Where's your Kanyo? Oh, conclusion. Okay, so this is paragraph one. So you have to put like that, like paragraph one must put like that. Ah, dun, 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 dun. Oh, no, 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 this one is not, this one is not bullets. Oh my God. Hey, shucks, man, why not again? Oh. Can you do this? Ah, okay. Can you do this? No, this. Ah. Okay, I know what to do with it. Give me a minute. Yeah, okay, I got it. Oops. Okay, that's a good one. So, can you finish everything? Han Ling, you left your conclusions and paragraph three. Kang Yao finished everything already. Well done. There's your paragraph two. Yeah, that's what I mean by point form delta. Okay, well done. So we did have paragraph three and conclusions and uh handling also conclusion as well as paragraph three. Paragraph three, Chow. Okay, thank you. So tao, Tata. <clears throat> Oh. Now we have one paragraph three for conclusions here. And we have this one for conclusions. And then we call it the day. We'll see you on this Thursday. And Thursday we'll do the one social economy All right. All right, Zach, thank you. Well oh. done. Well, I need to go to the, the bedroom with this damn freaking hot. Oh, uh, no, not again. I'm going to do it one more time. That's good. That's much better. Oh no, just put it here. All right, that's good. All right, that's much better. All right, conclusion, both of you, conclusion, and we call it the conclusion for today. Yay. Tell you, Of course, we would like to read your story next week. That will be the best to end the grand finale for next, this coming Thursday lesson for social and economic impact. Thank you, in conclusions. Okay, well done, baby. So, left, um, Zachary, your conclusions. Can you stay back for a while, okay? Thanks, huh?
Okay, thank you everyone for coming for today's Tuesday lessons. Um, everyone can leave the Zoom except Kang Yao. Thank you, Han Ling, Zachary, and Tian Yu. Have a good rest. I'll see you this right, Thursday. Thursday. Got it, got it. Thursday, Thursday, this Thursday. Bye-bye.